today we're unboxing a whole bunch of brand new toys. They are all the brand new series of everything you can think of. We have brand new Zuru mini books. They're tiny little books and I even heard they have actual writing on the inside. We also have these new Snackles and there's so many more new toys. A brand new series of mini brands, Series 5, and Series 2 foodie mini brands, Series 3 of mini brats. And guess what? There's 40. I counted 40 of them. That's a lot of toys. I think first I want to get into these brand new mini brands books. Oh, right there with real readable pages. I hope we've got some Goosebumps books on there. Here we go. Okay, we've got one whole capsule. We're not doing the little compartments. Yeah, we've got three, four bags. Oh, okay. L.J. Smith's The Vampire Diaries. What? We've got a first horror themed book. And you guys know we love our scary stories here. Well, actually, Vampire Diaries is not really horror themed. <laughs> if you guys watch the show, it's pretty much a, a love story. Ew, okay. All right, so we've got our book. What's our next bags? What? Oh, of course, Zuru is gonna make us build stuff. Uh, is this a bookshelf? Do you like building stuff? Cause I don't. Do you wanna build a snowman? <laughs> I don't. All right, so here's our first bookshelf. And then we get to build on top of this. The more bookshelves, the higher the bookshelf. I mean, the more shelves, the higher the bookshelf. Oh, but you don't want to miss out on these other bags. What could we possibly have in here? Let's see, is it another book? Here we go. What is it? Hollow City. Oh, it's another creepy. Oh, Miss Peregrine's Hollow City. Hey, I've got this book. That's a very good story. Yes, sir, it is. And look at our tiny little book pages. Here's the back. Okay, here's the next one. Is it another book? We've got three books. Nice. Okay, this one's a cutesy little babysitter's club. And here's the back of it. Our dollhouse is getting real books. So here's our bookshelf. We don't really have a, a shelf going, but don't worry, we'll get there. Here are our books so far in our book collection. I think we've got some good reads. Look at that. That's looking real cute. Okie dokie. Here's everything we've got still. And uh, we're gonna just shimmy them into the frame because they keep on trying to get away. How about we try a Snackles? Ooh, that's fun. It's by Zuru. We've got a little plushie in here and we also get a fast food item in there. So cute. We've got unicorns and push pops, dragons and reeds. Okay, whoa, all right, here it is. We can already see what we've got. It's a little puppy and he's so squishy and soft. He's like a marshmallow and look what he's holding. It's a Hershey's milk chocolate bar and these are actually hard. We've got the nutrition facts and everything on there. Let's take a look at our little puppy. What? Our puppy's missing a tail. It's okay, little puppy. You can be tailless. We still love you the same. Anywho, what else did we get in here? Looks like we're getting something, a snack? Surprise snack. Okay, our little puppy came with food. No, he did not. Oh, well. He's got stickers. We've got a Hershey sticker and a Snackle sticker. And we get to learn a little bit more about our puppy, maybe? Here's our little puppy story of how our little puppy likes Hershey's, apparently. And also, here is our collector's guide. It's Benji. Aww, he's so cute. Oh, what? Yeah, you're Benji. Time to go flying. Bye-bye. Yeah. Oh, Benji's okay. We, we play like that all the time. Anyways, let's go ahead and look for our next surprise. This time, let's try some food. Foodie Mini Brands Series 2. This is the brand new series. We don't have any other new series besides this one. As of today, that is. But maybe they might come up with a new Series 3 soon. All right, we're looking for the Frozen Moments ones. We have to set a goal for each and every one of these. It just makes it funner. Here's our first bag. What have we got? Oh, we 
we've got a foil wrapped hot dog from, is it from, oh, it's from Auntie Anne's. I was gonna say Sonic's. So it's like a pretzel dog. I wonder if you could get these out, unless they're glued on the inside. I don't wanna mess it up. Oh, the paper is rippable. And it feels like it's glued, so I'm not gonna mess with that. Oh, we've got some super rares. That's a super rare right there. So here's the Auntie Anne's pretzel dogs. Uh, it looks like it's a common. And it also looks like you could get it out of the packaging. I mean, that's what it's showing over here. Here are the ultra rare frozen moments. We've got curly fries popping out of there from Jack in the Box. Original stuffed crust pepperoni pizza with a slice popping out. And the Kura Tonkatsu ramen noodles with the actual noodles coming out with the chopsticks. What have we here? Triple threat box. Oh, we've got some money. Money from where though? Ah, oh, it's a euro? Yeah, we've got $100 in euros. Ah, it's a pizza box. Naughty or nice, we all get a slice. Looks like it's holiday themed pizza box. <laughs> Did I just say it was a triple threat box? It's a triple treat box, not a triple threat box. Of course, we don't want a triple threat box. <laughs> Next bag, what have we got in here? We've got, is that tater tots from where? Jack in the box. Never mind, those are chicken nuggets. And here's our next one. We've got a White Castle burger. It's a cheeseburger. And our last bag. It's a drink. Ooh, that smoothie looks yummy. Oh, is this Jamba Juice? Yes, huh? It's a Jamba Juice Mango A Go Go. All right, let's check all these off. We've got this one, this one, this one, and this one. Oh, yeah, in our money, we have. Which one do we have? I would say this is closer to that one right there. So I'm gonna check it off. I say we did pretty good for our first go. All right, my lovelies. What should we go for next? Let's do a Bratz Mini from Series 3. Our baggies are pink. I think they've always been pink or maybe purple. Here's our collector's guide, just so you guys have a little look-see at who, what? Are these Monster High Dolls? No, <laughs> this jade fooled me. It's Tokyo A Go Go Jade, and I thought it was Cleo Denial for a second. Why on earth did I think these are Monster High? I thought maybe they were gonna surprise us with the collab. But what was I thinking? Monster High and Bratz? I must be crazy. All right, let's go for this first bag. Who is this? Oh, she's got electric hair. It's Sasha, live in concert. And here is the back. It's the first ever pop group. And our next doll is... Oh, we've got a styling head. It's Yasmin, funky fashion makeover. Next up, let's do one of these yellow balls. These are the Mini Brands Fashion Series 3. Let's see this first bag. What have we got here? We have some sneakers. They're rose sneakers. And it looks like we've got a headband and some glasses with actual folding arms. Neat. And one more bag. Only two bags? Oh. And I think we've seen these sort of bags before in the previous series. Let's see. This opens up. It should. It's not opening. Oh no, it broke! <laughs> My bag broke! All right, so this is everything we've got in the first capsule. Okay, let's keep going. Which other toy do we wanna see first? Let's do some of these mini little tykes. These are series three. All right, what do we get? We can see it right over here. Nothing hidden. We've got a Tykes Place? Okay, let's see. Whoa, we've got tiny little blogs. That's so cute. Okay, let's see, do we actually have the Tykes Place? Yeah, look how adorable it is. It's a little dollhouse for our dollhouse. And you've got little blocks to pretend play. Our next toy is a party kitchen. Nice, I'm definitely having some parties in this kitchen. Oh, you best believe it. Look at this. Oh. This also has tiny little pieces. All right, little tykes. You guys are 
amping up your game here. We have our tiny kitchen, okay? With a little side table, an actual little chair, and tiny pieces, and they're like a tiny little bowl. They're so teeny tiny that I don't wanna lose them. Oh my goodness, we even have a super micro mini potted plant. It's so tiny and so tiny. So let's see if we could even get this on here with the tweezers. There's one cup, and here's the other one. Oh wait, there's that. And we've got, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. A tiny little bowl. It's like a circus act. Ah! Don't run away, little bowl. I mean you no harm. There you go. It's like a little kitchen for our ant farm. Oops. Tiny little kitchen for our ants. And then we've just got our regular old usual stuff, like the little stands that you put onto the ball. And now we are on to our next toy, which should we open next? Let's try another foodie mini brands. Or actually, this is actually just mini brands. Uh-oh, it's stuck. We have a stuck wrapper. Looks like this one was playing out in the sun for too long. It's so all melted. Ooh. Well, okay then, let's see our First baggie, what do we got? It's a bowl of ramen noodle soup. And remember, these are groceries, they're not the foodie mini brands. We are shopping for some more soup. We've got tomato soup. And what's this? We've got some sugar-free bazooka bubble gum. Hey, ah, uh, can we open this? I don't think so. But we've got something in there. It's pink too. Here's the next one. Oh, some more Campbell soup. Are we running a theme here? This time it's another round of chicken noodle soup. We've got chicken and chicken. And uh, our final bag. We have an office supply. It's a tape runner. We've even got frozen moments in the groceries and some more stuffs. We've got some boxes like from FedEx and UPS. I think UPS Cutie will appreciate that. No. And a new uniform. Next, let's take a look at some more books. We need some more books in our library. Okay, here's our shelf. That's a definite now. We know the chunky bag is the shelf. And here are our books. Whoa, what was that? Something popped out. Oh, cool. We've got a bookmark, and this is a hardcover book. It's Cat Kid Comic Club. We all know that the hardcover books are the expensive ones. Oh, wait, what? Only a couple of the pages are printed? What happened to the rest of the pages on this one? Oh, and it's not our first hardcover. The Hollow City one is also hardcover. Next book is, oh, it's a Matilda. I love that movie. Such a fun movie. Now let's take a look inside. All the pages are printed all the way to the end. Our next book is Goosebumps. Yay! I didn't even know they included it in the series. I just was making a wishful guess. Here we go. What story is it? The Haunted Mask. Have you guys watched our OMG version of it? It's Are You Afraid of the Dark, though? I just took the story from R.L. Stein. <laughs> all right, neat. So these are all three of our books we got this round. Whoa, we didn't even take a look at this collector's guide. You guys, we've got in the iconic section, Stranger Things, Worlds Turned Upside Down. And then our legendary is, I think, a glow-in-the-dark version of Night of the Living Dummy. And luxury are these three old for rare, we have Diary of a Wimpy Kid. And the bookmark we got is this one right here. So to add more shelves, all you have to do is not add the top part to one of them. Oh yeah, and don't add the bottom parts too. So basically, just leave it at this part and then you'll be able to add them to each other like that. Then we'll actually have a super long bookshelf. And maybe we can stop at around three or four shelves. Otherwise, it'd be way too tall. Let's add our little books. Here's this one, the Cat Kid comic, Goosebumps. There you go. There's our cute little book collection so far. Next up, we are looking at another Snackles. Yeah, that's what they're called, Snackles. 
Let's see if we can get the unicorn. Oh, cute. We've got a little sloth. Is it a sloth? It's like a tiny little bubble gum. And we've got some Mike and Ike Mega Mix. <laughs> Look at the hair. <laughs> and they all have little stories. Here's her story. Aww. So it looks like she went digging for some Mike and Ikes. Or no, she planted something grew a rainbow tree and from the rainbow tree it rained Mike and Ike's? Cool. I want a tree like that. So we got Susie. Let's check her off. All right, let's shimmy up our roundup, get them all in one place, and let's do another foodie mini brands. Here goes the first bag. We have, ooh, yummy, some P.F. Chang's. Is this chow mein? We have P.F. Chang's lo mein. Here we go with the next one. Whoa, this one's big. What's this? It's something from Cinnabon. Oh, whoa, what's in here? Let's get it on out. Whoa, yummy. It's one, two, three, four Cinnabons. So that was Cinnabon Bon Bites. Let's go ahead and check. Check her off. Next up, we've got more Cinnabon. Is this the one with the pecans? Or the pecans? Oh, neat. This one actually opens up. Look at that. Our Barbies have some Cinnabons. This is perfect Barbie size. So one sixth scale is what the size of this would be in doll food. That, my friends, is a Cinnabon Caramel Pecan Bun, or Pecan Bun, depends on how you say it. Two more things, let's go for this one. We've got, oh, Pizza Hut on the edge. It's that super thin one, oh neat. I would call this fully functioning doll food. You can actually take it out. They would have really took it to the edge if they had slices. So here of all the pizzas is the edge, number 40. Let's check a -roo. And our last one is, oh, we've got like a granola bowl from Jamba. Jamba Vanilla Blue Sky Smoothie Bowl. All right, order up. Let's see some more mini brands fashions from series three. Here we go, what are we getting in here? Tons of little pieces. Looks like we've got our first set of heels. These are fancy. And here is a bracelet with some lipstick. Does this whippy stay out? Oh, it does. It's not a real one, but it actually opens up to a cute little fake whippy stick from the Homey Depot. And in here we've got our bag. Ooh, this one's fancy. This reminds me of a Marc Jacobs bag. Let's see, does this one really open or, or will it break on us? Oh, neato. We've got, oh, we've got like a little sash in here. It's teeny tiny. Let's put it right back where it belongs. Righto, let's look for another book. I think I like the books the best. Here's our shelf. And our first book. Oh, I think we've got another bookmark in here. Yes. Oh, we've got a duplicate of the haunted mask. And this time we have this bookmark. Next book is Reminders of Him. What's that? And here's another one. Oh, cool. We have a magnifying glass and Mad Libs. Oh, this will definitely help us read the book better. Look how much it's helping us already. Look at that. You can already see it so much better. Mad Libs is a game for people who don't like games. Poppycock, who doesn't like games? Here's some more mini brats. Ooh, what's this? It's a phone booth. And you can take it out if you want. Our tiny little brats phone booth. Does the door actually open? We've got a tiny little phone in there. <gasps> it actually opens! We have a Bratz boy. It's Kobe. Let's look at some more mini brands, series five. Will we get a frozen moment this time? That actually looks delicious. Ow. Ugh. It's melted into the capsule. What are we getting? We're getting some Milano dark chocolate cookies. Next, we have 
Whoa, that's a big can of Fanta. Zero sugar. Why all the zero? And what's this? Cute. Is this a toy? Oh, it's one of those post-it dispensers. Alrighty. We've got a UPS box. Somebody sent us something. What did they send us? What's in here? Oh, it's a heavy coin. Wow, it's a doggy. Neato. This is a pretty hefty coin. Whoa, cool. Here's what we've got. Let's check it off. Next up, we have our very last bag, and it's a can of Campbell's Chunky Beef with Country Vegetables. Yummy. Let's check out this cute little Snackles. Oh, it's a little elephant. Aw, look how squishy and cute. They look like little babies. Little baby elephant. He's got a Mentos. Those are actually my favorite. Let's see our little elephant story. So here we go. Looks like our little elephant was taking a walk with his Mentos and then he saw his little friend. Something about Mentos. They got an idea to do something and share the Mentos, I guess. This was Lottie. Lottie da -ti da. Let's dive into some more food. We've got money. What's this? Some um, euro. I think we've got this one before. And we also have something from Pizza Hut. Ooh, yummy wings. And next we're getting, oh, it's like a bacon burger. And here we have a drink from Jack in the Box. And some sushi. Yum, yum. Our last bag is. Oh, what's this? Oh, you can actually open it? Righto. But you can't take it out, can you? Nope. Looks like this is some kind of beef and rice. Oh, it's P.F. Chang's Mongolian beef. Let's check that out. Sounds tasty. Jack in the Box's Sourdough Jack. And the Super Salmon Light. Looks like we also have a miniature version of it, and that is an ultra rare, I guess. Oh, they're the mini minis. So we've got the regular minis of all the foodies, and then we also have the mini minis. That's what the little green star means. How about some more books? So here's the shelf. Let's leave that and go straight to our books. So, oh. We've got another bookmark. This time it's this one. And a duplicate, another Cat Kid Comic Club. And here's the next one. Ah, we've got our first Stranger Things. It's Darkness on the Edge of Town. And we've got a story, yay. Our last book, it's Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. This looks like a picture book. It's not, just maybe some pictures in there. Here is the back. So here is how tall our bookshelf has gotten. Let's just connect the last one. This is four all together. Okay, we gotta be real careful so it just doesn't collapse on itself. We still got a pretty good chunk left. Let's look for some more foodie mini brands. Bag one, we have some more Mongolian beef. Bag two, oh, we've got some hotcakes or pancakes. In here we have some more Cinnabon, but what is it? Oh, it's the little donut bites or something like that. The next one feels like a drink. We've got some more Jamba Juice. This one looks like it's a matcha drink. And in the last bag, we have another drink. It's lemonade from Auntie Anne's. Okay, so the mystery green drink was a Jamba Gacha Matcha with Sweet Cloud Whip, mini pancakes from Jack in the Box, and Cinnabon Cine Sweeties. Let's stack up on our fashions. Here we go, you guys ready? Here's our new bag. We've got the barrel bags, and they actually open. They're like little garbage cans, yay. And oh, what's in here? This feels different. Feels like jelly beans are in there. What on earth? Oh, we've got a little pet. <laughs> oh, cute. And it's got a little French beret. And what else was in there? What was feeling like jelly beans? We have a bow. Is this for our kitty cat? And here are our sneakers to run away from the kitty cat. 
Just kidding, only plastic ones. Here is our catastrophe, it's right here. It's a lelk, itty bitty kitty cat. What? And our garbage can bag is right over here. How about some more mini toys? And here we've got two trucks. Oh, this is so cute. This series, you actually get miniature toys that goes with the toys. Here is our farm tractor truck. And then you have your little farm animals. Which farm animals do we get? We've got, looks like a cow. Oh, animal down. And the little animals go in the back. We've got, oh, oh no. These are just so tiny. Here we go. Our farm truck is ready to go. And here's our fire truck. We've got a set of four toddle tots in here and a little puppy because they're fire tater totters. And there's a spot, for, oh, actually, whoa, whoa, okay. Is this the hose part or is this the ladder part? Next up, let's try a snackles. Oh boy. It's Big Bubba. He's got a Cinnabon. And it's a little hippopotamus. How cute. Look at the teeth. It's Toofy. This was Hugh. Time for some more books. First book is, oh, is Mad Libs again. And with Mad Libs, you also get that magnifying glass. So this is our second one. Next up we have, oh, we keep on getting this one. This is the third duplicate, the Haunted Mask. What about this one? Is this a new one? We have Matilda again. This ball was just a whole bunch of dookie plits. Let's go grocery shopping. Oh boy. First bag up, we've got some banana boat, sunscreen. And what's this? We've got some post-its. Oh, with no post-its inside. Should we check it? Any post-its in here? Nope, no post-its. Next up, we've got another Fanta Zero Sugar. And, oh, we've got some money from where though? This is Japanese Yen. And we also have some Jelly Belly Sours. Last bag up. We went shopping for popcorn butter. We got rich and we went shopping. Let's revamp our closet with some more Mini Brands fashion. Let's go inside this bag first. What do we have here? We have a shawl, I think. Yeah, shawl or neck scarf. And we also got that uh, belt, I think. This is a belt. Yeah, a needle. It's got these cute little charms on there. Is it a charm bracelet for us? I think it's a wee bit too small. Oh, and look at these cute shoes that fell out. These are pretty. And inside this bag is our handbag. We've got this perfume bottle bag. Does it actually open? Oh yeah, it does. It's kind of like a pocket watch. Let's see, what have we got left? I still say it's a pretty good chunk. So let's go ahead and do another foodie mini brands. Bag number one. We've got, oh, cute sushi. Anything in this section is a mini food court exclusive. That's what that little sign means. It's a Kura Tuna Nigiri. Let's go ahead and check that off. Let's keep them coming. Oh, we've got another. Wait, what's this? It's a bowl. Is this a frozen moment? <gasps> we've got the frozen moment. Yay. Finally, I thought we were not gonna get a frozen moment because I pretty much never get a frozen moment. Let's stick this little extra piece in there. This is like the puzzle piece. And Viola, here it is. It's the Kura Tonkatsu Ramen Noodles. Let's check out the next one. What have we got in here? I think this is a duplicate. This uh, Buffalo Wings. Oh, it's a mini pizza, <laughs> mini pepperoni pizza. Cute, LOL size. And what is this chunky? Monkey. Oh, it's the same, uh, what is it? The sourdough. And our last bag. That's the matcha drink again from Jamba Juice. All right, some duplicates, but some very cool new additions, including our ultra rare frozen moment. How about another Snackles? Yay, we've got the unicorn! And the little unicorn has gold. Very cute. Oh, cute little pudgy wudgy marshmallow unicorn. 
Okay, let's figure out our little unicorn story. Oh my goodness, look at those kisses. This was Richard. Okay, Richard. Let's grab some more books. Here we go. Some more books to fill up our library. What's this one? No more duplicates. Okay, we've got the red bookmark again. And a new book from Miss Peregrine's. It's Library of Souls. And here's the next one. Stranger Things, we've got this one again. It's a dookie plit. That's okay, that's okay. Maybe this one's not a duplicate. It's a different Vampire Diaries with Stefan on there. All right, let's check out some more of these brats since we've kind of put this one off for last. First one up feels chunky. Is it another styling head? No, it's a Bratz TV. Is there an actual TV in here? Whoa, neato! There's an actual TV in here. I thought they were just gonna fool us like Zuru. Here it is. Oh. Oops. And we've got Formal Funk Sasha. Here's the back. Let's see, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. Oh, this one's trying to get away. So let's open this one. First grocery. Looks like we're getting some more tape. We're getting some cornflakes. Who puts sugar in their cornflakes? Be honest, I do. And sugar is a sometimes food, we all know that, yes. Unless you have a sweet tooth, of course. Just kidding, okay, it's a sometimes food all the time. Okay, we've got this before, bowl chicken flavor. Ramen noodles. Ramen noodles is a sometimes food too. Oh no, did I rip something? Aww. I ripped a tiny miniature mini brands collector's guide? What's this? Oh, it's a little, like a, uh, what do they call these? Like shopping magazines? And I ripped it. Oh well. Let's try this next one. What's in here? Ooh, goldfish. But it's not goldfish extreme for those of us who like extra cheese. All right, here's what we got in that one. First tobago, we've got sneakers again. These are high tops. What else is in here? I think we've got everything. So sneakers, a necklace, and some whippy sticks. And what is our bag? It's blue. Oh, cute. How about another snackles? I wanna say snackimals for some reason. Here we go, it's a new one. It's our Subway uh, Husky. I think this is a Husky because it doesn't have a raccoon mask. You guys can make up the story. So our little Husky's name is Nigel. I wonder how they came up with these names. Oh, and you know, I noticed one other one that I really want is the Haribo one, Nancy. Oh, and also the little Brittany, the Chupa Chups. Danny, Danny's got Tabasco sauce. All right, Danny or Nancy, let's see if they are in this last Snackles. Who have we got? It's a duplicate. We've got our Mentos one again. We have no more Snackles left and we didn't get the other cute ones, but that is A-OK. -okay. Here we go, here's the first one. We have a new one. Is this the giant pretzel from Auntie Anne's? <laughs> it is, ginormous pretzel. What about this one? Oh, we've got a giant fish and I don't know what that is. Is this like a dessert? Ah, it is. It's a Kura Taiyaki ice cream in our giant Auntie Anne's soft pretzel. What about this one? Oh, something split in half. There's one right here and one right here. Cool, we've got two. Ooh, what is this? It feels like tacos. Yeah, we've got Jack in the Box tacos and two of them at that. You know, I thought that was gonna be like a special rare one, but it's not. It's Jack in the Box, two tacos. Two more bags left. Let's try this one. It feels like a drink. It's a new smoothie from Jamba Juice. And this last one, I felt a drink. Oh, it's the same one from Jack in the Box. How many do you see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven left from 40. We've come a long way. So if you made it this far, I think you definitely deserve a million toys and to be on Santa's good list this year. And extra brownie points and sprinkled candies, a yummy cake, 
and some jumping ice cream. Sorry. Well, hello there. Looks like we're out of groceries again. First grocery. Let's see, what could it be? It's a smint or an S-mint. And some more of those empty box post-its. What about in here? Is this Jelly Belly? Ah, it's only one flavor. It's the popcorn, buttered popcorn flavor. How about in here? Powerade? It's Powell Aid. The LOL speech is getting to me. How about in this one? We've got a bag in this one. Grocery bag. Because our shopping's gotta go somewhere. Let's just put all of our groceries in there. Buttered popcorn, jelly beans and all. Now look, we have tiny toys again. If you need mini toys for your small dolls like LOLs and calico critters, these are the way to go. Oh, and this is a duplicate. We've gotten these before in our LOL Candyland game. Let's not mess up the box. Oh, I messed up the box. Oh no, it's not wanting to open. Well, the box is a little damaged. Here's our little cabin and our railroad ride on. These are the only ones that didn't have the tiny little minifigures to go with it. This one you just attach like that and off you go. Almost finished. How about we do our last foodie mini brand? Bag number one. Oh, we've got something different. Here are our sushis or these are our fish eggs. Next we have, oh, we've got a boba tea drink from Kung Fu Tea. Here's the next one. Is this a duplicate? Yep, it's a personal pizza. Here's the next one. This one's new. It's a double cheeseburger from Jack in the Box. And the next one, this is the last one. We've got the same lemonade from Auntie Anne's. Okay, just in case you were wondering, that's what that first one was. Ikura Gunkan. Two more groceries and two more fashions. Oh, whoa, okay. They're both trying to get away. Let's go ahead and go for this fashion. All right, here's our next bag. We have a blue trash can. And, oh, a little kitty cat. Oh, look at our heels. They look like peacock or parrot heels. And here is a little bow elastic. I wonder if our kitty cat could fit in there. Kind of, sort of. The rest of our things can though. Voila. Let's change things up with our Mini Brands groceries. Oh, first grocery is Paste Picante Sauce. We have this giant Revlon nail polish and a glue gun. Neat. That's something new. How about in here? Tabasco Sauce. And we have some more Campbell's Chunky Beef with Country Vegetables. Two more left. You guys made it to the end. Let's try the fashions. What will be our last bag? Oh, these are new shoes and a whole bunch of new accessories. Does that mean it's a new bag? Here are the Jade Hunter shoes. And looks like we've got, I don't know what that would be. It'd be too small to go around her waist. Oh, maybe a choker and a headband. Our bag is this one. So it's the white version of the blue one. Now let's try the last groceries. Oh, everything went everywhere. It's a FedEx box. Let's see what's inside. UPS gave us a gold coin. FedEx is giving us a Slurpee. I like Slurpees. FedEx with its Slurpees. I'm sure it's melted. What's in here? It's a Fanta. And in here we have, oh, some of these little toast chi. If you like peanut butter, then you're good to go. And here's a Fruitella Summer Fruits. Yummy chews. And in here we have so squishy. I'm sure there's a sponge in there, but it's Kettle Brand Potato Chips Sea Salt. Well, that's our show for today. Leave me in the comment section which of these toys were your favorite that we unboxed. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.